принесу вас в область боевых действий. Приготовьтесь к бою. Перенос завершен. Скоро начнется военная игра. Отличного дня. То вам предстоит тестовый бой в динозавра. Экзобойцы и визы за наблюдателем. Миссия отстрел динозавров. Готовлю зону действий. Призываю рамтеров. Призываю рапторов. Призываю рапторов. Достигайте целей медленнее команды врага. Переход к следующей миссии. Миссия отстрел динозавра. Готовлю зону действий. Призываю рапторов. Призываю рапторов. Призываю рапторов. Призываю рапторов. Призыв по хицефалозавра. целей медленнее команды врага. Миссия отстрел динозавров. Готовлю зону действий. Призыв прицеладуса. Отстрел динозавра. Вы достигаете 
целей медленнее команды врага. Предупреждение. Сейчас начнется финальная миссия. Готовьтесь к путешествию. Будет битва. Побеждает команда, первая добившаяся всех указанных целей. Делайте свое дело и предоставьте мне данные боя. и атаковать врагов. Призыв трицератопса. Прогресс обороны области 25%. Прогресс обороны области. Призывает 
призываю Раптора. Прогресс обороны области 25 процентов. This suit moving. Suit? What? Emergency shutdown. Ah, hell in Powder House! Sandy, what's happening? My initial analysis of the data intercepted in 2040 showed potential compatibility with the exosuit system. So I plugged it in. Naturally. It did prove compatible. That's good, but you know, maybe don't do that again. Sandy. What is this data? All exosuits are designed to periodically transmit data packets back to IBS during the war games. This is one of those packets. So it's, it's what? Control commands? The near field signal from pilot to suit? Negative. Original exosuits were designed with burst transmission capabilities from the onboard memory. The file in question appears to be a data block recorded from the brainstem bypass. That shouldn't be possible. H how is that possible? Suit control is an analog neural signal. One way from Ace's brain to the suit's body. What we're looking at is a digitally processed recording. Affirmative. I'm waiting for the problem here. I need to take a look at this. Hey, Ace, check this out. You know how exosuits were developed right here on the island. We're starting to find data recorded during the development process. Play it again, Sandy. Understood. <clears throat> okay, we are rolling. Sound? Check. Video? Do we have video? Check. No screw-ups, please. Anchor Division Exo Fighter Program. Combat data collection test number 12. Test pilot, are you with us down there? All set, sir. Okay, uh, first we'll activate the brainstem bypasses transmission system. I didn't feel anything. <laughs> you wouldn't. It's a, it's a passive system. This test does have an active element, though. Okay, let's start firing at him. Bring up the 9 mil and give me a two-second burst. Scattered. <laughs> You're doing great. Just uh, keep dodging. Is this safe? Didn't you tell him we were running a live fire test today? Sorry, sir. 
Well, it's too late now. It's perfectly safe. They tell me that armor is very thick. Keep hitting him. Are you trying to kill me? That is great. The more data we get, the better. This is all helping to make a better exosuit. Whoa! See how we dived away there? Split-second thinking. That's the kind of instinct we can use. Any response from Leviathan? It's saying insufficient data. <sighs> that machine is never happy. Well, we can push our pilot a little harder. <laughs> Analysis results ready. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Ace? I may have some bad news. Chief? What's wrong? Look, exosuits are piloted via the brainstem bypass, right? The neural link to the pilot. That pretty much means the suit is accepting data directly from your brain. I've been trying to figure out why the exosuit is storing and transmitting that data during the war games. Well, look at this experiment they were doing with exosuits back before the incident. Okay, uh, first we'll activate the brainstem bypass's transmission system. Any response from Leviathan? And we checked out the exosuits, and it looks like Leviathan's implanted a data collection program into their firmware. Like, all of them. We never would have noticed it if it weren't for Sandy's little... experiment. Sandy. That is his way of saying, well done. I am pleased to be of assistance. What does Leviathan need exosuit data for? Is it tracking Ace's location and vitals? No. No, what Sandy intercepted is much more complex than that. You see, this component in the exosuit spine, the memory buffer, is saving your neural signals. Ace, it's gradually building up a data file. And it is a lot of data. I've confirmed it, Ace. Leviathan's collecting your reactions to heat, explosions, oncoming dinosaurs, the way you respond to every combat scenario, and maybe even more than that. Listen again to the audio from Anchor Division. Combat data collection test number 12. Split-second thinking. That's the kind of instinct we can use. If Leviathan's building a database of exo-fighter responses, all your combat instincts, then by the time we learn how to destroy it... He could already know everything about you. Chief, you must disable this. Make it stop transmitting. I can't. Not without unlacing the entire neural wheel that drives the control system. Like it or not, the exosuit's keeping is alive out there. But the more we use it, the more it helps Leviathan. Результаты загружены. Закрываю временный образец. Выжившие, подготовьтесь к отбытию. Хорошего дня. Magnum, you must rest now. You're torn up worse than I am. Ace, talk some sense into him. <laughs> he has head of pig. Oh, come on. I can... Oh! <laughs> I can talk and heal at the same time. <sighs> Listen, Hawk I know you're thinking it. You want to take down one of those watches, don't you? Chuck a little high explosive into Leviathan's eyes and ears. Job's a good one, and we all go home. There was one crew that tried, and I saw the pieces 
After Leviathan is done with him, that AI does not take kindly to destruction of IBS property. If we're going to strike at Leviathan, it has to be the core. And that's someplace up the Stratovator. How the hell are we going to get up a space elevator when we can't even get this carrier off the ground? I've found something, something that might just help. If I make any progress on it, I'll let you know. In the meantime, you've got to play nice with Leviathan until the time is right. <laughs> Easier said than done. <laughs> You're not wrong there, Vic. This is the second time you call me this. Vic. You know me. In your timeline. You might notice that me and Lorenzo are a little understaffed over here. Not everyone made it in our crest. You mean? <sighs> if it's any consolation, you didn't suffer. It is not consolation. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess not. Magnum, do not speak as if I... That thing that people say about you... It's bullshit. Don't believe it. What do people say about you, Victoria? It is not your business. Right. Well, uh, you look stay alive out there. Especially you, in her case. Hmm? Like I always say, sometimes the coin comes up heads. But sometimes not. Surely a Pacific Island is not the best place to put your space elevator. There is a reason for locating... Oh, wait, I know this one. Vicatoa's near the equator. Makes it easier to build a cable going straight up to a geosynchronous orbit. Correct. I watched a documentary about it. I will add ten points to your score. Sandy, is he making you keep track of his petty victories? It is not a difficult task. He is often incorrect. Please push a notification to my console when the score changes. Now, wait a minute. Confirmed. Hang on now. This facility at the bottom of the Stratovator, this is Anchor Division, yes? IBS's top flight research center. Points to you. I need no points. Exosuits were developed right here. For all we know, we've crash landed where they used to test them. Uh, no, no, Sandy's fine. I just forgot to charge the arm. This thing is as dead as a AAA in a nun's. Uh. No, well, never mind. Have you ever tried plugging a cable into your right elbow with your left hand? Allow me to assist. Oh, no, no, you don't have to. The cable is connected. Thanks. You know. There's a time when I would have hated that. I've always wanted people to know I don't need anybody's help. I've got my life sorted. Sorted right out. And my one room IBS bed sit is just... a bump in the road. And then I lost the arm, and I just... I just... Right? Right in overdrive. I'm fine. I don't need help. Just stay away. I am an autonomous unit as well. No. No, you're not. You're part of this crew. You see, if you go on too long, thinking you can get by alone, pretending you're better than the other working stiff so you don't have to do anything for them or, or them for you, pretty soon you've only got yourself left to despise. It was Ace and Chief that set me straight, convinced me to pull my head out of my ass. They got me to stay. After, if they hadn't been around, I, well, and getting burned alive will screw with your worldview. Oh, 
Right, I, I never told you, did I? Yeah, well, um, the old arm wasn't cut off or broken or anything like that. A Heisel tank exploded in our hangar, and my suit caught fire with me inside it. No warning, just bang, and my ace was right there with me. The fuel lines in my arm were burning. The hatch control and emergency hatch port detonator both malfunctioned. The suit recorded everything, so I know I was conscious for 32 seconds before I blacked out. An ace dragged me to the chem shower. Felt longer at the time. Ace got hit pretty bad in that blast as well. Spent a day in intensive care. You should see the scars. Anyway. We both figured there was nothing worse the Exo fighter life could throw at us, so why not keep going? Ibis actually paid out a hazard bonus for that one. Of course, by accepting it, we waived our right to sue for damages. Where it goes, I guess. You really are messed up. God, Madge! There's someone should put a bell on you. This is a, a private conversation. Does a man get no privacy? We're living inside metal bucks. Everybody hears everybody pee. Don't get bashful on me now. Especially with such a badass story. Right... There. On the control platform. That's where Leviathan's core is. So... You're telling me this thing we must destroy could not be further away unless it was in space? Oh, there's no good news without bed. My calculations confirm you are correct. Come on, Madge. Stay positive. Look at it this way. Yes? We'll likely starve to death long before we manage an attack on Leviathan. <sighs> Just like my grandmother. These people got the crap end of the stick. Well, it's inevitable, isn't it? The price of progress. How do you say that in Bikatoan? How many times did this succulus rot before the crash? 104. I was being rhetorical. On every patrol we've flown around this island, I've never seen more than a wasteland. But there used to be people here. Culture. No one talks about that. Only Leviathan and his damn dinosaurs. You know, Chief, Ibis has never officially revealed what caused the incident. But look at this. Here's the section of the Stradivator that blew up and caused the collapse. It's marked as a communications array, but there's obvious comms equipment on the upper section. I smell cover-up. Sandy, bring up that photo of the wreckage I found out in the jungle. Displaying. Compare it to an image of one of those vortexes showed up in the war games. Image comparison reveals a positive match. That's Vortexer technology. Massive, braided right into the Stradivator. Okay, okay, okay. But what caused it to explode? Couldn't say. But there was some kind of energy pipeline running through the whole cable, all the way up here to Leviathan. So the question is, what was Leviathan doing with these vortexes? It all comes back to Leviathan. Hold on. Chief, you may be onto something there. The war game gives us access to 2040, right? If we destroy Leviathan back then, Leviathan can't cause these vortexes to blow. We... We could prevent the whole thing. You really think we can be so precise as to destroy Leviathan without 
damaging the Stratovator? Hey, we're the Hammerheads. The name sings with precision. <sighs> I... You do know you're the only one who causes that 